guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'll be doing this makeup look right here. I also posted a video about this baby before. You can go up there and see um, the video. And yeah, today I use uh, all matte eyeshadow except for my inner corners. So and it's pretty simple. I use Morphe 35K, my natural palette, my favorite natural palette so far and uh, yeah if you want to see how I do this look keep on watching I already put cushion my, on my face I'm just going to put some concealer on some parts of my face I'm just going to dab it Like so. Okay. I'm going to use this Yondu Kong shading stick. That one is also Yondu Kong shading stick. Uh, uh, this one is Yondu Kong brightening stick this one is Yondu Kong shading stick I bought this in mini box they have the trio one is blusher one is shading and one is brightener so I'm just going to use this right here like so do it like this and right here also with this one like so like so and I'm just going to blend this away with my sponge and I'm just going to blend it away with my sponge uh, sponge is here Blend that like so. So, I already blend it on my face. So, after I blend that, I'm going to use my powder. I'll be using my Claudine Spinal Loose Powder in the shade Light and I'm using Real Techniques Brush from the NYX Pix Edition it's a dual fiber like normal brush and I'm just going to use it on my face So I put my powder on already. I'm going to shape my nose and my face a bit again in just a moment. As usual, I'm going to take my Pony Effect Contour Palette. I hit pen already, if you guys can see that. I hit pen a bit. Maybe because I always use this every day. <laughs> I hate that. So, I'm going to just normally shape my nose, like so. Shape my nose already. I'm going to shape my face using the same, the darkest color in this palette, and I'm just going to do that quickly, like 
not actually contouring, but it's like bronzing it, but like contouring. I don't know what to say. <laughs> okay. Like so. And then I'm going to grab my Morphe 35K palette. I am just going to do a simple look. I guess I'm going to go all matte color today. Yeah, I'm going to go all matte today. So I'm just going to take my brush here and I'm going to dab it on this color right here. Um, and I'm just going to use it all over my lid. So. This is going to be my base color. After that, I'm going to take my brush and I'm going to dip it right here. This color right here and I'm going to use this on my I forget what this is but it's yeah, right here crease that's it as my crease color for a transition After I blend it out nicely, I'm going to use this color right here. And I'm just going to that right there just from the middle to up to to the outer V just like that my camera just died on me anyway I'm going to take this color right here dab it there and I'm going to use this for my outer V And I'm going to drag that a little down there. Like so. 
And I'm going to do the same with my other eye. Just pat it on the outer V and blend it. Like so and drag it down drag it down to the lower lash line. Like so. I'm just going to use the axis and use that all over my lower lash line. Just like so. And then I'm just going to use uh, I'm going to take this color right here right here this color which is the third color it's I'm cheating a bit this is a shimmer but I need to highlight my inner corners So I highlight my inner corners already and I'm just going to again try to blend it out again because some are on my eyeshadow so I'm just going to blend it out like so and then I'm almost finished with my eyes I'm just going to draw eyeliner Anyway, I'm going to use my uh, Aided House Drawing Show Creamy Pencil. This one's in the shade... I don't know. I think this one is a limited edition one. But yeah, it's actually like a normal dark brown eyeliner. You can always grab this color everywhere you want. And I'm just going to normally line my eye. And I'm going to line a bit right there under uh, for my under line. Just a bit. Just up until near my the black of my eyes. Like half lining it. Like so. And I'm going to do the same with my other eye. Like so. I finish eyelining my eye. going to use my mascara I am going to use my Mecca Forever Smokey Lash Mascara and I'm just going to 
lashes with this mascara, quick. So I already put on my mascara for putting off my eyelashes. I just put one coat today because I'm in such a hurry. I cannot be late today. And uh, what else should I do? Oh yeah, blushes. So today I'm going to use my Milani Big Powder Blush. It's in the shade Coralina. Grab my blush brush and I'm just going to dab this. Oh, it's super pigmented. Let me like, put this a bit right there and a bit right there. I'm running out of time. That's my timer right there. So I'm just dusting the blush a little bit, just a little bit because it's super pigmented. It's pigmented. Like so. So after I blend my blush, I'm just going to grab my highlighting brush and I'm just going to dip my blush on this on my brush to this color right here. It's called the Muse Maker. And I'm just going to like, highlight my nose with that. Keep it bill. My chin. And a bit on my cheekbones. And I always do this, I always put it here. I don't know why but I like to do that just like give an extra something and uh, yeah last but not least Last but not least, I'm going to moisturize my lip first. With this baby right here, it's the Vaseline uh, Lip Therapy Petroleum Jelly in Aloe Vera. And I'm just going to moisturize my lips. I should have done this from the beginning but I totally forgot because I was in such a hurry so yeah I get that now I'm going to grab my Misha Line Friends uh, Mixed Edition Lipstick and it's in the shade uh, Maple Latte this is their best selling color with along with salsa red.
This is a matte lipstick, but it's so comfortable on the lips. Like so. So, yeah, I guess this completes this video for today. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you love you haven't. Thumbs up if you like it. Comment down below of what you think about this makeup look. And yeah, um, I guess that's it. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye!